Jackie from Conroe has a question about salty water. Well, she purchased a water system, and now her ice cubes taste like salt. Ew. <laughs> Jackie, <laughs> I know. Jackie writes, I have a reverse osmosis unit under the sink, and the water seems to be okay. Yeah. And I pulled the shower handle off in the master shower, she says, and it's all white and tastes like salt. Now... Jackie, I love you. Yeah, don't stop putting too, your mouth. You do go, oh, what about that taste like? Don't do that. Be careful. Don't do that. Okay, so he says our house is only one year old. That's the topper. So, so Jackie wants to know, Tom, is there a better system than these salt systems for the water? Don't blame the system. Or I should say, don't blame a well-installed water softening system. It does not make the water taste like salt. Yeah, I think there I'm, is yeah. something wrong with your system. Yeah. Uh, the reverse osmosis will take anything out. That's the beauty of it. I don't care what you put in there. It's going to take it out, and you're going to get clean water. That's why that's good. And you might want to run that over to your ice maker, by the way. It makes much better ice out of the reverse osmosis. But as far as that salt in the water, uh, there should be very little. Something is either over-generating or something's not right with your system, so have it checked. Yeah, when I talked to John at Aquatex about this very topic, um, he had said with the ice maker in the fridge, even an activated charcoal filter, you know, one of those like bullet shaped ones, mm -hmm. will do wonders to the quality of your ice as well. Oh, no doubt. Yeah. So if you don't have one of those, you should certainly. And that's why a lot of refrigerators come with them already built in. Yeah, exactly right. All right. And our answers come built in when you send us questions at homeshowradio.com. So do these videos. They're built in in our free memberships on our subscription. That too.